The Silverstone Circuit's owner, the BRDC, the British Racing Drivers Club, has reiterated a financially viable British Grand Prix is the only way forward, ahead of its renegotiations with Liberty Media. The event was originally locked in to 2026, but is now in doubt after 2019. With the BRDC breaking its contract with F1 back in July to stem mounting financial losses, which totaled 6.3 million US dollars alone in 2016. And with the event expected to lose the same for this year's race, it's a situation that must change to secure the event's long-term future, says BRDC president and former Grand Prix driver Derek Warwick, who spoke exclusively to the inside line. We need to uh, make an affordable Grand Prix. If that's not possible, um, and maybe it's not, I'm, I'm not really sure, then um, after 2019, uh, there will be no British Grand Prix. Both the BRDC and Liberty Media are waiting until the end of the current season to talk, but Silverstone's owners are confident that a deal can be completed once values are aligned. Understand each other, trust each other, and uh, make sure that uh, we both want the same thing. Once we've uh, found that same desire, I think a deal will be done. For Liberty Media, it's a complex issue, with the British GP at Silverstone the first F1 race held in 1950, and the annual event one of the sport's best attended. But any cut price deal will set a precedent for other tracks to follow. We'll figure out what our next move is, but we're very committed to a British Grand Prix. Alternative host venues for the British Grand Prix are even less viable, with the suggested street race at London's Docklands said to come with a price tag similar to that of Monaco, Singapore, and even Azerbaijan. I think it's a pipe dream. You're never going to do that in London. It will cost between one and 200 million. Okay, you're gonna find some government to do that? No, I don't think so. It's a pipe dream. Given the history and passion for Silverstone, it's tough to not see a deal being done, but the terms could take years to be agreed. TheInsideLine.com for everything Formula One.